Okay, so I'm going to give a quick demonstration of my application VGame into the database at Beta. This is uh, I'm demonstrating the Pro version in this case. So over and above what I've written about my application on my website at uh, vgame.net, I will show just quickly what it does to uh, in order to maintain and update uh, or backfill an intraday database. In this case, it's going to be uh, the DAO 30. In other words, if I look at the symbol list, it's the 30 stocks of the DAO 30 that uh, I'm going to be updating. If I take a look at the symbol data, for example, uh, oops, excuse me. If I take a look at the symbol data, edit symbol data here, I can view, for example, Apple. Simple, it's a simple text file, and the last date that it's updated to is the 7th of October 2015. It should be updated to uh, the current date of the 9th of October. Okay, so now the updates can occur in one of two ways. I can do them automatically. In other words, I create a schedule and they're done, they're done on a daily basis at a specified time. This time should be um, your local time, but it should be after the close of the US markets. Okay, so, but just for the purpose of this demonstration, I'm just going to show updating of this database that I have selected. I uh, understand that there are a number of databases that I have currently that I maintain, and the one that I have selected is the Dow 30 5 minute var intervals. Now, to do that manually, I simply click update now and it should proceed to update each of the 30 symbols in this database okay it's finished now it's just a uh, doing a, a backup of the database. At the moment I'm maintaining in, uh, six historical um, backups. We all understand and appreciate the need for redundancy. I click yes to delete the oldest of those date backups. Okay, and that's, that's done. Now, to, uh, to, to verify that it's actually um, updated as I as designed, I go to the edit symbol data and I can select Apple as before. And if you recall, it was updated to the 7th of October 2015. So right now it's been updated to the 9th of October 2015. And you can see there is the continuity there's the 9th, the 8th, the 7th, the 6th, all the way back to when I started this. Uh, July, on July the 13th, 2015. Okay, so that just gives a quick overview of uh, what this application is designed to do in terms of updating or downloading, updating, and maintaining the continuity of intraday database. Thank you.